Hello YouTubers and welcome to the Richard Dawson Tribute. And this is Rodney1279 um, talking. How's everybody doing? And I hope everybody's doing great this evening. Well, if you saw the last game I played, I won $20,000 on on Family Feud Decades in the 70s version. Now, this game that we're playing right now, we're going to play a game that I have not played in two years. It'll be, it's Family Feud for a PS2. And I'm hoping I can win $20,000 here too. As y'all know, during this uh, tribute, I'll be throwing facts about Richard Dawson here and there. Like, I'm going to throw one right now. And many of y'all probably don't know this, but before he got into comedy and stuff, Richard Dawson um, had a stage name. Before he was called Richard Dawson, his name was Dickie Dawson. This was after he um, was discharged from um, the Marine, the Merchant Marine. And he had reached adulthood. He revised this to become Richard Dawson. The name he will later legally, the name, the name he will later officially legalize. That's some facts for y'all. Let's play some of the game here. We're going to play a standard game, obviously. One player. And we're going to the, f the fifth set. That's the Richard Dawson set. And we're going to the Flippins. My last name. And what the hey. Let's choose a random family here. I was going to choose my brother's family. And we're going to go average. And we'll see what happens. While this thing is loading, I'll give it's time another fact. Family Feud. The other fact is Richard Dawson, um, in 1971 to 1973, he was on the show Laughing. He was on the Rowan and Martin show Laughing. But before he was even on that, he was on a show called Hogan Heroes, and his character's name was Newkirk. Thank you very much, and welcome to the All right, Review. let's get right down to it. Let's see who's best at the face off. We have the top three answers on the board for the first round. Gotta think quickly here to give me a good answer as fast as you can. And by the way, y'all, I created my family to look exactly like my real family. So I hope y'all like it. Okay, you guys, good luck. This woman right here is my wife. Looks like my wife. Are on that board. You just have to tell me what they are. A circus animal that could go mad and injure someone. I gotta say a tiger. This should be very easy and quick. Only three answers on the board. Is it there? But it's at the bottom. It's up there, but there are two higher answers remaining. I would have said elephant too. The survey says. Yeah, number one. But that big move behind. Answer. Are you going to play or pass? It is. Well, I'm glad they passed that. That's me right there, next to my wife. A circus animal that could go mad and injure someone. I think they have bears at the circus. Lion, tigers, and bears. Let's see if you've won the first points of the game. Is it on the board? That's okay. Oh, I got it. Well, I said it already. Lying. Now, that there, next to me, that's my sister. I asked you to name 
a circus animal that could go mad and injure someone. Duh. You gonna ask me that question? I imitate them sometimes. I'm gonna go with a lion. Are these first points of the game yours? Let's see. Let's see if it's on the board. And that's good for 94 points. And remember, it takes 300 points to win the game. And should neither family get to 300 points, there will be a sudden death question to determine a winner. It's still anybody's game. The $20,000 could be anyone's. We're going into round number two, and I'll give another fact. Um, Let's do the face-off and see who takes control. From 1973 to 1974, Richard Dawson will be a regular on the new Dick Van Dyke show. Question. A way the little boy shows a little girl he likes her. He would uh hug her. Well, five answers can beat that. But there are five higher answers remaining. Hit her! The survey says. And it got up there higher than mine. It's better. You got it. Are you going to take control now or are you going to pass it over? Right, so you're going to play. Okay, while they're playing. I'll give out more facts. As most of y'all know, um, Richard Dawson was the first um, celebrity to be on the Match Game. So he was the first regular celebrity on the Match Game in 1973. And then Brett Summers and Charles Nelson Raleigh came a little later. Survey said. Flowers, okay. There are three answers left on the board. All right. And then along with him being on the match game, he was a regular panelist on I've Got a Secret in 1973 as well. Going to pass? Sometimes it's hard to think of an answer, isn't it? That's a strike. There are three answers left on the board. We wanted you to name it. A way a little boy shows a little girl he likes her. <coughs> he kisses her, he does. Let's see if it's there. That's number one. We've still got two answers left. Let's not forget one here. We wanted you to name it. A way a little boy shows a little girl he likes her. Who are here? Let's see if our survey agrees. That's probably up there, isn't it? Well, they could sweep this uh, survey. Are left on the board. All right. We asked you today. A way a little boy shows a little girl he likes her. A tricky question, and you've decided to pass. All right, two strikes. And we're hustling up. There's one answer still up on the board. I thought of an answer that one more strike and you'll lose control of the question. wasn't up there. Back to the question. You were asked to name a way a little boy shows a little girl he likes her. A tricky question and you've decided They showed in say buy her chocolate this or give her a gift. Up a little. Will the points be stolen? Okay, just one answer and you can steal the I have points. two answers, but I'm going to go with buy her chocolates. You have to be really fast on this one because the clock goes down quickly. You have to just keep moving. That's the go. The points could be yours. 
Have you stolen them? No, they got it. 72 points for them. What's number seven? What's number seven? Give candy. Now ain't that the same thing as chocolate? What do you think chocolate is? Candy? But that's okay. I'm still in the lead. Candy is chocolate. I thought, but that's okay. Let's do the face off and see who takes control. Here's my sister up there. Got the top six answers on the board. Let's make it more exciting. Let's double the points. Someone who had many followers. I'm going to say uh, the man upstairs, Jesus Christ. Say God, G O D. Let's see if it's there. All right, no. one strike. Five answers. There, right there, that's my mom. Okay. And the guy before there was my brother. Someone who had many followers. Oh shoot. Uh, how about the president? Time to see what the board says. Yeah, George Bush. But it could have been any president. Why has to be George Bush? Let's carry on. We asked you the name. Someone who had many followers. Well, if that's the case, how about Clinton? Now, the president could have been anybody, but they chose to put George Bush up there. Let's go. Our survey says one more strike. We got a second strike. But before we get into this game any further, we're going to take a quick break, and when we come back, we'll start the second part. See y'all in a minute. 